Hello friends, welcome to lesson 20 on Batch Script. In this lesson, we will talk about functions. So before starting, if you guys haven't checked my previous video on Batch Scripting, I will highly recommend you guys to go and check that out. The link will be in the description. So let's start with function. Basically, a function is a set of statements organized together to perform a specific task. In Batch Script, a similar approach is adopted to group logical statements together to perform a function. As in any other programming language, function in Batch Script follow the same procedure function declaration and function definition. Function declaration. It tells the computer about a function's name, return type and parameters. Whereas function definition, it provides the actual body of the function. Every function has a function name which describes the task the function performs. To use a function, you call that function with its name and pass its input values. So let me show you the syntax of a function here in the batch script. So you have to use the column you have used the colon, then function name, your function declaration, and the exist exit statement. Okay. So here, the function name is a name given to the function, which should have some meaning to match what the function actually does. And the exit statement here is used to ensure that the function exit properly. So let me show you an example how to write that in batch script. So we what we will do we use echo of to stop the echoing okay so colon let's say display okay so i'm creating a variable here a numeric type variable slash a and let's say index equal to five and let's print that variable echo let's say the the value of the index is percent index okay and let's write the exit statement exit slash p and q so save the file create a bad executable file let's say filler dot pat so what will happen in this case let's see so this should print the value of index is 5 but note here we haven't written the pause statement here so what will happen as soon as i will click on the file it will execute the statement and it will exit the file so at the output we won't be able to say anything at the output because it will happen too quickly so let me show you so if you see the batch file executed and once all the program inside the file has been done it exit the file so let me show you again i hope you are able to see it here so as soon as I double click on the file, the file execution start. Once everything is done, it exits the file. So to see the output, so let's say we hold the screen. So we have to use the statement pause here. So what it will do, it will hold the screen for us. So we'll be able to see the output. So the output of this should be the value of index is five. So let's check that. Here you can see it's print the value of index is 5. So that was all about functions. So this was the last video on the batch script. The next video series will be on the SQL database. If you guys have some choice or preference, please comment down. Till then, stay tuned, stay connected and thanks for watching the video.